Hi, today I am going to explain the chapter, first chapter of chemistry, acid bases and salts of 7th NCRT. So basically this chapter is uh, based on the three chemical components this, that is acids, bases and salts. Acids are the substances which are sought to taste. They are obtained from the or uh, derived from the word acidus or acid which also means sir. So it is a Latin word. So it it produces H plus ions when dissolved in water. So they are corrosive in nature. So when you add uh, acids such as H2SO4 um, or H2SO4 or HCl, they are too corrosive in nature. So they can dissolve any metal or go uh, gold. So gold can be dissolved by a substance name aqua regia, which we'll be covering in the later chapter. So there are different types of acids. So here I have mentioned some of them. Hydrochloric acid, citric acid, hydrochloric acid is, uh, is a synthetic acid, mm, sulfuric acid, nitric acid, acetic acid is found in vinegar, formic acid is found in the iron bites, citric acid is found in the citrus fruits, lactic acid is found in mil uh, sour milk or curd, Carbonic acid is present in uh, carbo uh, uh, carbo uh, carbon dioxide dissolved drinks such as co uh, Coca Cola, Pepsi, etc. Then malic acid is present in apples and oxalic acid in uh, tomatoes. So next we'll be learning about the reaction of the water and acid. So in the I have told you that the H, uh, when an acid is dissolved in water, it uh, produces H plus ions. So here we have dissolved HCl in uh, water. So we get H plus ion that is uh, from the hydro hydrochloric acid and the Cl minus. So when an acid dissolves with water, we get hydrogen ions. So I have given another example that is H2SO4 and uh, H2O. So when they dissolve, it gives two H plus ions and um, sulfate ions, which is SO4, two minus. So next we'll be learning about the classification of acid. Classification of acid is only based on the origin. So first, uh, first type is organic acid. So organic acids are the acids that are obtained from the uh, obtained from natural sources such as plants, animals, etc. These are uh, not produced in labs. They are only uh, found in natural substances. Example is citric acid which is present in uh, lemon and uh, malic acid in apples as I told you earlier. Next is organic uh, inorganic acids which are obtained from the labs or made in the labs or laboratories by man. Example is hydrochloric acid, acetic acid, sulfuric acid. So I have written uh, all the acids and their origin. So citric, uh, citrus fruits is citric acid, apples, malic acid, lactic acid, sour milk or curd, oxalic acid, tomatoes, formic acid, string of ants and bees, tartaric acid, tamarind, and acetic acid, vinegar. So these are the sources for the organic acids which is the one of the type for the acid next we are going to see about the sources of inorganic acid so it's not a source so these are the examples nitric acid sulfuric acid carbonic acid nitric acid which is uh, hno3 sulfuric acid h2so4 carbonic acid h2co3 and uh, hydrochloric acid hcl Next, the general properties of acids are they are sour in taste as we saw in the first and uh, uh, acid turns blue litmus to red. Litmus is a kind of an indicator which we'll be learning. So it turns a blue litmus to red color. So there's no change in a red litmus paper when it's dipped in acid. So the, there's an important note that is when uh, acids are dissolved in water, uh, sorry, when acids are dipped in a red or uh, red litmus paper, they show no color change, and in a blue litmus, they turn into red. So, this is the important note for acids. Next, uh, acid contains hydrogen ions or H, as opposed to ions.
so this science is produced when we dissolve in water they are also a good conductor of electricity as it contains an ion so aqua regia as a solution which can dissolve uh, gold and silver it contains hcl and hno3 concentrated hcl and hno3 uh, which is dissolved in the ratio of 1 is to 3 so this can even dissolve gold and silver next is acid rain earlier we saw that a uh, few acids such as sulfuric acid nitro nitric acid and carbonic acid which are uh, um, which are uh, synthetic or uh, inorganic acids so when gases such as sulfur sulfur dioxide nitrogen dioxide uh, mixes with the rain water they give us acid rain this acid rain contains the acids which i mentioned you that is nitric acid sulfuric acid carbonic acid etc so these these causes acid rain which are very uh, concentrated and are very corrosive so uh, the Taj Mahal is corroded or turned into yellow due to the presence of acid rain and many industries uh, around the monument. So next comes the basis. So till now the we discuss about the acids. So next is the basis. So which we'll be seeing in the next video. Thank you.